Hey paddlers, it's Ryan from Subscrub. What I can do with you today is talk you through how to use Subscrub on your older boards, your dirty boards, just so you can see the difference between how the paddleboard cleaner works for dirt and what are marks, just so you get a real expectation of what this, what this can achieve. So we're gonna take you through this very loved starboard. Um, as you can see, there are a few scuffs and marks and also a few dirt patches. We've got dirt on the deck, on the tail, on the nose. So this is definitely a good board to show you how to do a clean. As normal, we have got our SUP scrub, our eco paddleboard cleaner. We've got our bamboo drying cloth, cleaning cloth, and our agitator, our, our cleaner, our scrubber. First phase is the reach. Get the board wet, hose it down, get rid of the excess dirt, um, and allow the chemical to just clean the stubborn stains rather than the dirt that's going to come off. Personally, I always like to start with the deck. The deck pad is normally the dirtiest. So work in a section. So for your catch, spray a small amount of your chemical in the area you're working um, so that you're not wasting it. These brushes are ideal for the deck pad. Um, deck pad is slightly porous. These brushes really get into the pores and release the dirt, the organic matter, and all the stuff that's gonna make it smell. So to clean the hardboard, we recommend using a cloth. We love our bamboo cloths. They're nice and soft on the finish, um, but strong enough to get rid of any of the um, any of the dirt in the marks. So after we've um, applied our sub scrub and washed the board, next phase is the release phase. We're gonna wash the board off, all the muck we've just cleaned off it and remove the, uh, the sub scrub residue. Next phase is the recovery. It's time to let all your board to dry. Obviously, this has a slight recess in the board, so you need to drain it. So drain the board, get rid of any excess moisture. I recommend using drying cloth to remove any excess moisture off of the board. So that's how you use SUP scrub on a hardboard. Um, as you can see, it's not going to remove any of the damage, it's only a cleaner. Um, but you can see very clearly that the board is a lot cleaner. Um, you can see what our, what our paint damage. Um, so that's a realistic way of using the sub scrub. Thanks for watching the video. Uh, we want to see your before and after pictures. Use the hashtag I'm a scrubber on Instagram. Find us at sup underscore scrub. And uh, happy paddling, guys.